Once you've built your application, you'll want to start inviting your users to be able to use it. So how do we do that? The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the management panel and go to users. Here I have three users in my application. They're all me with different email addresses. And if I wanted to add a new user, I'd click on the add user button and type in their email. Now I can add multiple users by adding multiple user addresses or add them one at a time. Let's add test.kevincunningham.co.uk. I also have the ability to decide on the access role that this user will have when they log into the application. So they could be an app user. So that means they're limited to use a single application. They could be a developer. So that means they're able to change and work on applications throughout your BuddyBase instance. Or they could be an admin. And that means they can do some of the actions like creating users and those things that we're doing here. I'm going to make my user an app user and I'll add users. I now have two options. The first, I can send an email invitation if email has been set up in your BuddyBase instance. And this will send an email to my target email that they'll then use to confirm the invitation and set their password. Once they've done that, they'll appear in our users table. They won't appear in our users table until they've done that. The second way, I can generate passwords for each user. In this way, um, the users are immediately in my user table and I get a password that I can issue to them and expect them to change it once they've logged in. Equally, if I'm using a single sign-on provider, this is the way I should add the users and generate the passwords even if we're not going to have them because their email addresses need to be in our database. My user, I test at kevincunningham.co.uk has this password, which I'm going to copy. Now, if I sign in with my new user account, I'll immediately have to reset my password, which I'll do, and log back in again. Now, my app user account doesn't have any applications assigned to it yet. We need to explicitly assign a particular user to an application before they can use it. Developer account will have access to all the applications in your instance as well admin with our extra capability. So let's go to add this test account that we've logged in with, and let's add it to our BuddyBase University application. So I'll click on apps, BuddyBase University, I'll go along and I'll click on the manage button over here. Once here, I'll click on access, and I'll assign a user, the user I've just created, test at kevincunningham.co.uk, and I'll give them a role of basic. Now, when I go back to my test account and refresh, we can see we have access to this application and when it was updated last. So clicking on it now, the user can step in and use the application as it's been built at the last point of publication. I can also bulk import users and upload a CSV file, which has their, their usernames in it, and bulk assign them to whichever role I'd like to give. If I wanted to remove a user from a particular application from the same menu, I can just cross them off. And if I have to remove a user entirely, I'll go back to the users table, click, and I've got the option to, with these three dots, to force a password reset or to delete the user entirely. Lastly, I can update the user's role access and use their first and last name, which will be available in the current user bindings throughout the application.